It is not I, but God did all this. Adinayakanaya Sarveshwaran Adatin Sutanay Chamachan मम्मी अब प्लीज Father, praise be to Jesus. Praise forever. Whose house is this? This is our house, Chavra house. I am Father Thomas Palakil. I teach in Pallipuram Seminary. Father, please come to our house. I will come on my return. Yes, Father. My aunt lives somewhere here. I am looking for her house, the Kalasari family. It's on the third end. My son Kuriyakos will take you there. Kuriyakos, do you know the house? Yes, father. We used to play there. Oh, that's fine. Come, Kuriyakos. My son, thanks for showing me the way. Now let me show you a way. To where, father? The way to God. Don't you like to be a priest? Oh, how much I like to be a priest. I will speak to your parents. Oh, mother will say I'm too young. She thinks I'm still a baby. She's right. You are young. For some time, you stay with your parish priest so you can see your parents. Then I shall take you to Palipuram Seminary. This is the prayer our father in Syria. Father, some visitors for you. Kuriakos? Yes, father. You help your friends with the lesson. Sure, father. Let me meet the visitors. Abunda Bashmaya. It means our father in heaven. Although we say our father in heaven, God is very close to us, closer than we can think. We call our God dearly, more dearly than we call our fathers, like dear Papa. Kuriakos, father is calling you. Some visitors have come from your home. From my home? Why my father and brother did not come? Your uncles have brought some sad news. What? What happened? Kuriakos, we never know the divine will of God. Some epidemic happened in your village smallpox and the government passed an order that no one should go out of the village nor should anyone enter the village it was to check the spread of the disease to other places so they could not come early and give you the news what news isn't everybody well at home that's what they have come to say that epidemic took away your parents and your brother my father, my mother, and my brother. No. It's really very, very sad, my son. We never know the will of God. Let's pray for their souls. For a few days, you may go with your uncles. Father, 
father D. Avracha, what he said is true. It's the only one to carry on the family line. I spoke to Kuriakos, but his decision is firm. Moreover, there is no praise in our Chavara family. It's a great blessing from God to have a saintly priest in the family. Let him join the seminary. God will look after everything here. Thank you, Father. Thank you so much. Father Kuriakos, today I feel very happy after receiving the permission for our long cherished dream for the monastic life. I feel more energetic and enthusiastic. The See, Father Porukara has come. Kanyantara Jacob also is with him. This young man is with a lot of fire and seal within him. Were you waiting for us a long time? No, let's go now. Now more than 15 places we saw and how many miles we travelled. Pullarikund was a beautiful hill but the objection of the people also is right in that way. They think it is the sanctuary of goddess. We should not build our monastery hurting the sentiments of the people of any other religion. You may remember the place I have shown you on the way to Pullarikund. Maybe that is the place God has shown for us. We shall go there. This place is really beautiful. God through different ways was leading us here. Now both of you are back here. I think the Archbishop was pleased by your obedience. Very soon we have to complete the works and start monastic life over here. Hey there. I saw Father Chavra going this way. This way? There stays that big cobra which has killed many Come, people. let's go and see. Take something to kill the snake. Take rest. Let me pray for a while. Do not hurt anyone. Go on your way. Today is the happiest day of my life. We got the recognition and permission for our congregation.
Father Prior, today there are lots of people in the construction work. We have no money at all to pay the wages. I too am thinking of that. People have generously contributed to all our works. We are doing the work of God and God will provide us. Father, I like to contribute some money for the monastery. You have given a big amount. If needed more, please send someone to me. Thank you, sir. May God bless you. What's your name? Appu. Appu. Do you want to study? Mm. I'll come to your home and talk to your mother. Come. Apu says he wants to study. Yes, he's interested very much. Then send him to our school. Father, people won't allow us. We are of low caste. Our children should not sit with other children. In our school, you can send him. There, all of them sit together. Now, he tends the cattle of the landlord. So, at noon, he gets meal there. Father, if he goes to school, who will give him food to eat? In our school, we will arrange midday meals. Next Monday, send him to our school. We will give him clothes too. Father? putting rice in this? It is Father Playa's suggestion that we give a small portion of rice for poor children every time when we cook. But this is very little. True, this is very little. But if we give every time we cook, it will be a good portion. And if every house gives like this, it will be so much enough for many children. Every Saturday, we have to take it to Father Chavra. Mummy, next Saturday I will take it to Father Chavra. Sure. My mother is very sick. Father, please come to give her last sacrament. Let me take the holy oil. Did you tell Father that she has caught smallpox? N no. You know very well that he may not come knowing that. Father Prior, do you know that she is written with smallpox? So what? No one visits such patients. Even doctors and relatives refuse to go. I'm a priest and it's my duty to go. The rest I leave to God. Come, let's rush. Father Topil, this is the land I spoke about for the convent, from two persons. With people's contribution, we will complete the construction. For the beginning, we will make a temporary convent. Walk fast. Father Prayer is coming to preach. 
walk fast walk fast otherwise we will not get place dear brethren in our lord jesus christ let love be the law of your life let that love compel you to forgive each other remember that the lord jesus himself is present in front of you the day in which you did not do any good to others will not be counted in your life your glory and splendor oh son of god i long to see your glory